Hello, fellow travelers. Uh, today will be a. I want to share a thought with you. It's quite brief, and a food for thought. It's permission to be seen. Now, for myself, I've had some interesting encounters with therapy in my life. As a young traveler, I was told that therapy is not the way, if you will. Over the last seven years, though, I know this is not the case. It's not a recommendation for anyone to seek therapy unless they believe it may help them navigate the journey. What I learned in my experience with therapy is I'm giving someone permission to see me see that for me that's very interesting very interesting because i i enter to a space that allows for thoughts to be expressed in an unfiltered way to another person and when i first started i would be concerned with how i may be viewed by that person but I learned quickly that that didn't serve me. So when I interact with a therapist or someone who is uh, sharing that space with me, I tell them exactly how I feel. I found quickly that when speaking to someone that's not connected to your life, you get feedback that your normal environment may not provide. You ask questions that you may not explore when you're thinking alone. It's uh, it can be helpful. You may even realize that the person that you thought you were, you truly are not. I've come to realize that the environment that we build for ourselves, and it can just as easily be a prison. That's why the caged bird sings. Because when one is trapped in their in a reality, I should say, of their own making, that experience, it becomes oppressive. One cries out for attention and hopes that someone or something might help free them. Just as the caged bird seems to be noticed. Once one accepts that they are the makers of their life experience, only then can they escape the cage existence they have constructed. I mean, that's, <laughs> I won't say it's truth, but there, there's some truth in that. I mean, truth is different for us all, right? The idea is not to replace one cage for a larger cage. The aim is to stay in touch with the freedom that is one's birthright. So essentially what I have learned over my experience, especially over the past seven years of my life is allow yourself to be seen and let the cage birds sing. You don't have to concern yourself with why they sing. You are a reminder for them that they too can be free as well. Live your life, your true expression. Don't get caught up in the expectations of others. Don't even get caught up in expectations of self because those are nothing but cages. Sing for your freedom. Express for your freedom. To demonstrate it. Not to wait for somebody to come save you. Some journeys can be long. Some journeys can be short. One thing that doesn't change is it's yours. So forge that path. 
I champion for you. And I hope you find all the things in this life that you are looking for. Those are my insights. I hope you share yours as well. Until the next time, be blessed.